my viewers and welcome to some more F1 Sprint Lobby Madness. We are actually in a Sprint Lobby by the way, and we are in the Force India and we are at Australia, so... Hopefully this goes as well. Oh wow, what a douchebag, the other one backed out. So there was, there was four and now there's three of us. Starting on second, and we have a Salma and I've got a. I was about to say Vodafone. <laughs> We've got two Italians and a McLaren and Salva. Lights out, away we go! Using half out Curse Bar, and we get a pretty good start. Not the best, but alright. Put the brake bikes to the front, and the McLaren's laying, and he's just smashed us out of the way like we weren't even there. <laughs> so now we gotta basically push as hard as we can to try and catch back up. And hopefully pass him. And the McLaren's dive gone way too far into brakes, and he's ended up out breaking himself into the gravel traps. Now I've got the Salva in front of us, so we're gonna try. <laughs> and he's lagging great. Yep, he's lagging real damn bad. And then there's another lag. I'm not even gonna bother counting how many because this is just gonna be a lag fest. And there's only three of us. Three, two, one. Yep. Three, two. One, he's gonna lag in a few seconds. Anyway, yep, there we go. There's the lag, and we're just gonna dive straight the inside of him here. And I don't know why my driver put his hand up, even though we didn't touch him. Well, as far as I'm aware, we didn't touch him, but oh well. Moving on now, we're gonna start the second lap, and we get in first place. So let's hopefully hold on to this position to try and take the win for once at basically what is the closest race to our home Grand Prix basically and what's the gap oh well no this is just going to be a boring map isn't it well I'm not even going to bother commenting on this because yeah Alright, so, since the LA was so boring, I'm actually going to wait out for this Salva because, yeah, there's no point in me running away with the rest because it just gets by, and he's late again, great. Alright, so, let's do this. He is lagging real bad now. And, how the hell did he manage to get a squalify? That makes absolutely no sense. So now this is going to be absolutely boring, so we're going to have to wait out for the other guy. We're gonna let him get ahead a bit, cause Anne is in the barrier, and now he's absolutely gone. And he's managed to get up the road about 500 meters or so, within 0.5 of a second, which is a new world record. <laughs> but anyway, so now we're gonna try hunt him down with about one and a half sectors to go. Let's see if we can make this work, or whether we're going to actually fail at this and come back second. So now flying through the chicane, through the right hander, going to jump the curve a bit, oh well, who cares, flying down the back straight part, whatever you want to call it. In the seventh, we've used half our curves, but I'm in second, now he's gone off, he's gone off, is this going to give us an advantage, we hope so, and no it's not, because he's lagging all over the fucking show, great. Yep. We're literally right on this date now. Is this going to work or is it not? And we've just crashed into him and I've used all my curse bars. To oh, for fuck's sake. Nah, that just killed it. So, if you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to like, subscribe, and I'll see you later. Fantastic. 18 points.